What's going on guys? It's the VPN Ranger and I'm going to be showing you how to change your IP address to a different state. Alright, so in order to make this happen, you will need to be using a VPN service. Now you might want to be accessing a website that you can only access if you're actually located in that state. There are another number of different reasons you might want to do this, but the VPN we're going to be checking out in this video is going to be NordVPN. They are my favorite for state, you know, specific locations. I'll have a link in the description if you want to check them out. And before I log into my account on here, I just want to pull up their main website. Now this is a paid service, okay? It's like $10 a month to use, literally the cost of Netflix. There's over 5,000 different server locations you connect to across uh, 62 different countries. So I mean, if you wanna like connect to a certain state, that's cool, but you can also connect anywhere in the world, which is awesome. They also have some really cool security features on here. I'm not gonna get too into it, but they've got military grade encryption that is uh, basically use a tunneling service to take you through one VPN to another VPN. So nobody can really track you at all, which is awesome, right? All right, so let's log into Nord, and um, I'm just gonna let everybody know if you're on Windows, Mac, iOS, Android, everything is gonna look the same. It's the same, you know, looking platform uh, for when you log in. So there are a couple different ways you can connect, right? Now you're gonna have the option uh, where you can you know, connect through the map or you can pull up individual states and connect to them as well. So I'm in the Chicagoland area right now, but let's say I wanna you know, connect to, let's go with, uh, let's scroll down a little bit more here. Let's say I wanna make it look like I'm in New York, right? I would just click on New York. You'll get a new IP um, up here. It goes green and then it actually pulls you up on the map too, which is kind of cool. But um, it'll go green, it'll show you a new active IP based on the state you're connecting to. And if you want to disconnect, you can just press the little disconnect button. And then of course, um, you know, you can browse for some other areas as well. So let me go back to the US here and then we'll, uh, we'll try another state to connect to. All right, so let's just browse it up here. So we did New York, let's go with Las Vegas. Let's check out those Las Vegas servers. All right, cool, so now we are in good old Las Vegas and you can see that the uh, IP is completely new up there. And the other thing I wanna point out too is that when you've connected to you know um, any location on here, it stays connected. So you don't have to worry about like disconnect issues or anything like that, and everything is completely secure. So I'm gonna actually disconnect from them, but uh, that's pretty much it. I mean, it's really that easy. Uh, Nord's awesome, like I said, it's very user-friendly to use the app no matter what you know, you're using, if it's uh, you know, a phone, a computer, it's all good. So if you have any questions about them, hit me up below in the comments, I'll get back to you. I'll have a link down there if you wanna check them out. Please hit the like and share, thanks for watching this, and we'll see y'all later.